Hello everyone, welcome to the IchimokuCharts.com analysis for the Aussie dollar, US dollar FX 4 hourly charts for Monday, February the 28th, 2011. Well, a fairly uh, bullish uh, few hours of trading today and we have a series of green-bodied candles as the market was rallying and testing a previous area of resistance at around 102. We can see back here previously about... Uh, a few weeks ago where the market uh, tested this 102 area, the market actually traded to 101.999. So uh, the market tested just above that area today, just poking through there, which is what we expect markets to do. And then uh, we had uh, a slight sell-off as evidenced by the small shadow on the top of the candles that represents selling coming in. In this uh, final um, candle that we're looking at at the moment, uh, this is not a complete candle, although it is uh, quite bearish at the moment. So uh, we can't really really analyze that candle until the market's uh, completed. So the market is uh, trending up still if we're looking at the second last candle, but finding resistance around that area. Now the market is trading up above the Ichimoku cloud, so the market has an overall positive bias. And it is a fair way up above the cloud and looking a little bit overextended. Now when we look at the other indicators, the pink line represents the Kijun Sen, and that represents trending action in the medium term time frame and the market is a fair way up above there as well so it's telling us that the market's bullish in the medium term time frame but that uh, indicator the um, kitchen sin has actually turned flat and when it tends turns flat there is a, a possibility that the market will retrace back towards there so we do need to watch the low of this previous candle this green body candle for a potential lower high and lower low and for the market to perhaps retrace back towards that area now uh, just below where the market's trading at the moment is the Tenkan Sen and uh, the market is trading up above there obviously so that tells us that the market's positive in the fast term time frame but that will offer itself as support so that's around 1016 and that coincides with this uh, major swing high that we had in the market uh, around 101.650 it was actually at 101.57 uh, so uh, that is a possible area of um, support for the market which is roughly in the area where the tank and center is trading now uh, down below there we do have a few other areas roughly around this area uh, 101.3 there's a zone of potential support where there was previous resistance in the market, so some fairly good support down below here for the market. Uh, to the upside, though, the market is trending up. We remember we are in a second time frame uptrend uh, defined by a series of higher peaks and higher troughs and still in a first time frame uptrend. So we do need to watch this 101.2 area. If we do have a bullish breakout up above the 101.2 uh, high that we've seen um, in the uh, current candle that we're analyzing that's the second last one then there is a possibility that the market will trade up to 103 so there's a very strong chance of that but uh, as we've said to the downside we do have good solid support so uh, let's wait and see how this pans out for the market um, over the next uh, trading day